Hello Capricorn, I hope you're all doing well. Welcome to Reading Cell. Please keep in mind that this is your reading and it will not resonate forever. Okay, for Capricorn, please spread. What message for Capricorns? A love situation for Capricorn, please spread. Okay. So at the bottom of the deck, we have the Seven of Swords. Someone in this situation, okay, it could be a person, could have left you unexpectedly, was very sneaky about it, could have lied to you, okay, then say where they were going, what they were doing, okay. Some could have just uh, explored another uh, direction here. But you could have suffered emotional loss. Some of you could have also suffered financial loss. It's not going to be for all of you. So let's see for the present situation. The three of pentacles. So someone here in this situation wants to work things out. After leaving unexpectedly, someone here wants to find a resolution wants to either rebel this or fix the issue find a compromise why is the three of pentacles the star healing someone wants to heal this situation so aquarius here someone left where there was wish fulfillment here someone left yeah a situation where there was wish fulfillment Someone left a situation where someone could have gotten involved in a third party, but then at the same time, we're still hoping to be with you, still daydreaming about you. You were constantly on their minds, someone who could not stop thinking about you, and now they want to work things out. Why is the star here? The Empress. So... Yeah, someone here sees you as the one, their wish fulfillment, the one and only. If they are with a third party, it's like it does not compare to you. So we have Taurus Libra energy here. Because you're very good to this person. They feel like you didn't deserve what they did to you with the Seven of Swords. Yeah, you were very good, very nurturing. Let's see. For the blocker potential. The Nine of Swords. Yeah, someone here is like very stressed out. Someone has a lot of regret here. Could talk about a third party. Regret for getting involved in a third party. But there's sleepless, sleepless nights. Someone's definitely overthinking about the situation here. Nine of Swords, the star. Someone could be obsessively thinking about this. And there's a lot of stress and anxiety, a lot of regret. Why is the Nine of Swords here? Why is the Nine of Swords? The Ace of Swords. The Ace of Swords is right under this star. So someone here has the clarity. Has clarity that you're their, their wish fulfillment here. You're the star. The Empress, the star. You're it. So they have a, a lot of clarity about this. They can't ignore it anymore. And now they're very stressed out about it. Why is the Ace of Swords here? Why is the Ace of Swords? The Two of Wands. So it puts this person as a, at a crossroads. Because now they're like at a distance from you. You may not be together. Okay, so there's distance. They explored another situation possibly here. And so wherever they are. They're not happy because the whole time, I mean, they're stressed out because they've come like to some sort of realization, to some sort of, you know, epiphany here that you're the one for them. And they want, they want to take action towards you here and, and try to fix things. Let's see for the recent past. For the recent past. The Seven of Cups. Yeah, someone here, right, had other paths, other options. 
other choices seven of cups a lot of confusion not knowing in which direction to go here at the time someone was a very very confused but there's an ace of swords here so there's like a lot of clarity now there's no confusion here but someone here now is you know regretting their choice the choice that they've made why is the seven of cups here why is the seven of cups and the five of wands so there could have been a conflicts between you two so this person you know having options not being focused right in this connection on this connection created conflicts between you two because they were not investing they were very scattered okay very all over the place here and so created conflicts between you two there was a lot of inner conflict in the past the five of one seven of cups could talk also about inner conflicts this was highly confused about what it is that they wanted here and there could have been competition with the five of wands so why is the five of wands here why is the five of wands that ten of wands someone ran away from this from this uh connection here because Someone here was avoiding some sort of investment, responsibility, commitment, working things out, okay? They, you were not on the same page with the Five of Wands. Yeah, there were a lot of conflicts. You could have fa felt drained, okay, emotionally, physically, because you wanted for things to work out. You wanted, you know, a partnership here, but your person, I think, was running away from, thought maybe it was too much responsibility, too much burden. Yeah. So, the, I think this person, you know, then ended up, like, leaving here, okay? Yeah. Someone who was non-committal. So, let's see for the focus, for the focus. The Queen of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Well, someone's viewing you in a very, like, different way. I'm getting here very attractive, very confident. I'm getting that this is you, the Queen of Wands. Yeah, the Queen of Wands. Someone has a high focus. Someone's obsessing about you here. Where's the Queen of Wands here? The Three of Wands. Yeah, someone is waiting to move in your direction here. Yeah, someone's, like, spying. I don't know if you can see this. But wherever they are, <clears throat> it's dark. They're not happy, right? With the two of wands, they're at a crossroads about it because they're not they're not happy. They, wherever they are, they need to, you know, turn on the lights because it's dark. It's like could be depressing where they are. They definitely don't like where they are. And then they're spying. There's like a telescope here. And this is where you are. That's what see, this is how it is in the reading. This is like you're here right you're here and they're spying on you and you carry the light okay hope with the star hope someone still has hope here to be with you hope wishing to be with you yeah happiness okay and there's a lot of clarity where you are as well that you are the one so you're everything here for this person so there's a waiting period they're waiting to to move. Why is the three of wands here? The five of pentacles. So there's distance, but they're, I mean, with the queen of wands, they're pulled in your direction. There's attraction. There's passion. Someone's very attracted to you right now. Okay. They may not be telling you this because they're in their heads about this nine of swords. So five of pentacles, okay, it, it talks about distance. Someone here could also have financial problems someone who is not a able to give you that equal give and take yet okay so five of pentacles talks about an imbalance there's like no reciprocity at this point they feel like they, they're not ready to move yet in your direction there's a lack there there's some sort of lack here but they definitely are very attracted to you they're very passionate about you so this person thought that they would leave, right? And they would be fine with a third party, whatever it is. Okay, it doesn't have to be another romantic situation. 
could be family, friends, you know, could be work, could be, you know, anything here. Definitely, there, there's definitely distance between the two and where they, they are. I mean, they can't stop thinking about you. So let's see for the near future. The Eight of Pentacles. See so what they were avoiding in the past with the Ten of Wands? Investing, right? Committing, then putting an effort. What they were not doing because it's just too much burn. It's too, it, it was too hard for this person. So, yeah, they're, they're working on it, right? So there's an imbalance, but they want to correct things. They want to put an effort here. Why is the Eight of Pentacles? Why is the Eight of Pentacles? The Nine of Wands, very determined about it. The whole time they're spying on you. They're hiding. Like in, like it's dark. It's dark. It's like in, like some sort of submarine here. So they're like hiding. But still, they have, again, that telescope. They're like spying on you the whole time. They're hiding. They're in hiding mode, but they're, they have a focus on you. They they're, they're, might be working on themselves here. Why is the Nine of Wands? And the six of pentacles see because that's the goal so they want to go from a five of pentacles to a six of pentacles but there's going to be equal give and take and they're very determined about it but they feel that you could be uh guarded here the other energy from the nine of wands is that you know you could be guarded you could be hurt you may not trust this person and they know it so that's why they have to put in that extra work right to prove to you that they could give you that, they must work hard here, right? To give you that equal give and take. If you want this as well. They want to see you. They don't want to be in hiding mode anymore. Or pretending like, you know, they don't care. So let's see for the, what you should know. The Nine of Cups. Double wish fulfillment here. The Star and the Nine of Cups. Oh yeah, someone here is like... Someone here could have a drinking problem. Okay, it's not going to be for all of you. But someone here could easily give in to temptation. You know, someone who uh, in the past might not have had a lot of control. Okay, just giving easily to temptation, to, you know, other situations, choices. Who, who didn't choose like a path, a determined path and would stick with it it's just very yeah someone's very confused very scattered all over the place here but i think someone here wants to definitely choose a direction but it's a direction towards you so nine of cups someone sees you very determined here someone's very intense a lot nines talks about intensity someone has a lot of intense feelings for you why is the nine of cups here the king of cups oh yeah king of cups a lot of intense feelings unconditional love that someone has for you and someone is like feels like you're the one again this king of cups is like has a, a glass of wine here someone could 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 drink here a lot someone could be drinking to you know fill this emotional void being at a distance from you because someone has a lot of feelings for you but they're just hoping and wishing and they dreaming about you. They're not like being direct with you here. So Cancer Scorpio Pisces. Why is the King of Cups here? The sun. That's where they want to go. See? Where it's sunny, right? Where it's clear. That's, yeah. Six of Pentacles. Under the Six of Pentacles, okay? This equal give and take. This wanting to see you, interact with you, exchange with you. The sun, happiness, that would make them so happy here. So, uh, Leo here, that's where they want to go. Because right now, I think where they are could be really dark and depressing and they don't like it. So, let's see for the outcome. Let's see for the outcome here. The nine of pentacles. A lot of nines here. So, someone here, see someone has... I've. Someone has worked on themselves here. Someone's trying to be very balanced at this point, okay? With the Nine of Cups, Nine of Pentacles, in terms of, you know, someone's thinking about their well-being here. 
someone's thinking about their lifestyle, you know, and where they're headed and they don't like it. Someone's see, yeah, definitely someone's thinking about their well-being with the sun, the nine of cups, the nine of pentacles. And this is, is to be with you because someone feels really good here with you. So someone here, I mean, they're going to be in a very stable place. Also, if there was a third party in the outcome, someone sees to, seems to detach from that. So in terms of finances, someone might be doing well. Someone might be free of codependencies if there's like there were codependencies here. Also, obviously this does not happen overnight, okay? It could take some time. That's why there's that three of wands. Because the five of pentacles, someone's not ready, but someone's thinking about it. That's their focus here, okay? To be ready to come in your direction, to do everything, to put in effort and work. So that they can come in your direction here. So Virgo. Why is the Nine of Pentacles here? The Ace of Pentacles. Yeah, because now they're, they're able to give you something solid. That's their goal. Someone wants to really give you something solid. That's, that's what I see here. Because someone has the clarity, right? Someone has a lot of clarity that you're it. And no one else. So they're willing to do everything, right? They feel like, yeah, it's going to be worth investing in this situation here. You're worth investing. Because someone sees your worth in your value. I think you, this person could have taken you for granted in the past. But now they definitely see your worth and your value here. And they want to give you, see, now they want to give you the same thing. Because you could have given this also to your person in the past, an ace of pentacles, stability long term, because this is what you wanted, but they were not giving, able to give you in return. But now in the outcome, not that they're at the nine of pentacles, they're able to give it to you. So let's see for the ace of pentacles. Let's see for the ace of pentacles here. The emperor. Someone has leveled up here. Someone's all about commitment here. There is a big, big shift. So big, big shift here. The emperor, the emperor's all about next to the ace of pentacles. That's a very like intense energy, very, very powerful energy here. Because someone has never been able to, you know, release you here. Someone never forgot about you. There was definitely unfinished business in this situation here. Someone felt like, you know, they did a mistake here. By, by running away from this connection. So Capricorn, it's up to you, okay? It's up to you if you want this person back, okay? Because this person definitely has an offer for you, okay? This person is definitely coming your direction here with an Ace of Pentacles. So it's up to you if you trust this offer or not, okay? And uh, you're the Empress, you're in your power. You have the final decision. So that's it, Capricorn. So I hope it resonated with you. I hope you enjoyed the reading. Take care. Bye.